Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Angular is on the move now, as the beta version of Angular 6 was released on February 28th, and the production is expected to be released on March 28th. So what should we expect from Angular 6? Angular 6 is expected to have a better code for desktop file applications. We will see a better, smaller, faster, and easier version of Angular as compared to previous. So many of you wants to know what's new in Angular 6. Angular 5 has lots of bugs fixed in Angular 6. We also have addition of lots of new features and major changes in Angular 6. So let me tell you some of the major changes and features which you will see in Angular 6. First of all, you will see a better support for material design. Angular 6 has added a stable release for Angular Material and Component Development Kit. And the next major change is in Angular Forms. Calling abstract controls function mark as pending will emit an event pending. Previously, mark as pending did not have that event pending. And next thing is using Angular 6 you can bump the dependency on Domino to 2.0 resolve namespacing issue. And next, you will see that Angular 6 has a support for TypeScript 2.7. Currently, Angular 5 have a support of 2.6. And next, we have two major changes for Angular Common. The first one is improvement in ngif template error message. Now, ngif template will have improved error message. Previously, passing an invalid template in ngif have an issue of behaving incorrectly. And now Angular 6 will have this issue fixed for you. Now passing an invalid template in ngif will give an error message rather than behaving incorrectly. And second change in Angular common is you can export function to formats, numbers, persons and currency. And next, Angular 6 will have an improvement in platform browser as well. If you have used hammer.js, for adding touch gestures to your application previously in Angular 5. You might have came across an error hammer.js not loaded. This error is fixed in Angular 6. And next, you can configure hammer options for hammer.js as well. And next, in Angular 6, you will see few changes and few additional features in Angular code and in Angular Bash. Next improvement is better support for CLI. You will have improved universal and app shell in CLI. And you will also have sports server worker in CLI. And last, if you are new to Angular, and wants to learn angular so please subscribe my channel soon i'm going to start a series of video in angular 6 so please subscribe my channel if you like my video thanks for watching